Hi, welcome back guys. Today I am back with another new video. In this video, I will discuss with very interesting SQL problem. So let's start the video. First discuss the question. Question is the write and SQL query to swipe the seat IDs of every two consecutive students. Okay. So if the last student has odd ID, it's remain unchanged. Okay. So basically I have one seat table. In seat table, this is my entire data set. So basically in the data set, I have to two columns, IDs and name. So here you can see that for ID one name John and ID two name Tom. So I have to swap as ID one as Tom two as a John. So here you can see this is my expected output one as a Tom and two as a John. Now go with ID three and four three years for Vabna. Okay. So I have to swap as three as a Vabna four as a yes. So three as a Vabna four as a yes. Now go with ID 5 and 6 for ID 5 Aryan 6 as a Kiran. So 5 as a Kiran 6 as a Aryan. So 5 as a Kiran 6 as a Aryan. So I have now only 7, 7 ID there 8 ID is not present. So I have to not swap. So here you can see that if the last student has odd ID it remain unchanged. Okay. So here you can see that. So this is remain unchanged 7 as a Pratibha and 7 also Pratibha. Okay. So first I have to run this seat table. So if I execute, this is my entire data set. So I'll show you that how you can solve this problem. Okay. So first I have to find the total count of student. Okay. So I have to use count star. And here I have to use window function over and I have to use order by order by I have to give select null. So I don't give any column name as so I have to give as select null. See, select null using select null, I'll get the total student. So I have to give alias as total students. Okay. So if I run this query, so here you can see that I will get the total student as a seven. Okay. So this output I have to keep in CTE. So with CTE as select from CTE. Okay. So I have to give as star and now go with the next line. So now I have to check the case statement. Okay. So I have to use case when case when this ID if not equals to total student. Okay. For now checking this ID. Okay. For odd number or ID. So ID not equals to total student. So this condition is match ID not equals total uh, total student. So one not equals to seven and I have to give one more condition and ID modulus of two not equals to zero means this one 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 modules of two not equals to zero this condition is true then id minus one so so sorry this id plus one so one becomes two okay now go with the next case when statement so i have to use when now go with for this even number so id not equals to total student so this condition is to 2 not equals to 7 and id modulus of 2 equals to 0 then id minus 1. So now 1 becomes 2 and 2 becomes 1. Okay. Now go with the next condition when now go with the this condition. Okay. When when id no id equals to total student and id modulus of 2 not equals to 0 then i have to keep as id okay and i have to use one more condition else id minus 1 because if i have total 8 record then 8 become 7 okay and as new id so if I run this query, so I will get the new ID. So if I run this query, so here you can see that I will get the one as a two, two as a one, seven as a only seven is not changed. Okay. So I need here only new ID, new and so I have to use here select star. Okay. And comma is still there. So I have to use select from outer query 
and I have to give alias as A. What I need? I need new ID as ID. So I need this new ID as ID and I need name also. And I have to use. So if I run this query, so here you can see that. So I have to use order by also order by order by ID. So if I run this query, I will get the expected output. So if I run the main table also select star from sheet. So if I run, so you can compare the both the table. So if I here, so here you can see that one as a John, two as a Tom. Okay. Now one as a Tom, two as a John. Okay. Total I have seven record, seven Pratiba and seven still Pratiba. Now I want to insert one more record, eight record. Okay. So if I run this query, so here you can see that I have total eight records now. Total I have eight records. Now I'm going to run the now new query. So here you can see that it's working fine this query as a so one as a John, two as a Tom, one as a Tom, two as a John. Now go with seven as a Pratiba, eight as a AES. So seven as a EAS and eight as a Pratiba. So I hope you understand this video. If you still have doubt, please comment on the below. If you visit this channel first time, please subscribe this channel. We'll meet again. Goodbye.